Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see how to fix Samsung Galaxy Watch 7 fault detection not working. So the step one is to do, you can simply ensure that the fault detection is turns on on your watch or not. So to check, you can simply go to settings and then go to safety and emergency and then open it. And here when you scroll down, you will find here a hard fault detection. So right now this feature is turns off. So firstly you can ensure that the hard fault detection is turns on on your watch because when the hard fault detection is turns off so then the function will not work okay so firstly you can simply turn on the hard fault detection okay after that here when you scroll down you will see here are many settings like required swipe to call you can also enable this feature this feature prevent accident emergency calls you need to swipe the call button to screen after hard fall is detected okay also when you scroll down here a countdown that will automatically call an emergency number after 10 seconds play warning sound you can also test the sound here and then play sound on both watch and phone you can ensure that this will turns on because the when the two sounds are combined then the sound frequency goes to a many distance okay so then when a hard fall detect a many people's listen the sound and they come to you and they help you okay so also you can here set a number for emergency contact or you can here also adjust when to detect falls so like only during workout always okay so you can simple set it always because you can because anytime the accident happens okay so you can simple ensure this settings must because when this settings will not turns always so then it will simple detect fall detections during only workouts okay also when you scroll down you will find here many things and also the automatic calls on emergency number when you watch detect hard fall okay so when and after that you will see your issue will resolve so if your hard fall is turns on and still you are facing an issue so in this case you can simply do a restart a simple restart can resolve many issues so to perform a restart you can simply press and hold the power button and bottom button together until you see a samsung logo on the screen so once you see a samsung logo you will see that your watch will restart in two to three minutes this can resolve many issues because some bugs and some software glitches can be resolved okay so a simple restart can resolve your issue so it's time to check for a software update because the outdated softwares can cause many issues so you can simply go to settings and then scroll down until you find here a software update and then open it and then click on download and install okay so here you will find if any software update you can simply download it okay so right now in my case i hope that my watch is up to date okay so if a software update will not resolve your issue you will see on my screen my watch is up to date so it's time to do a factory reset okay so to perform a factory reset you can simply go to general in settings and scroll down until you find here a reset and then tap on it so before resetting it will tell you you can simple removing all mobile plans and then go next and then before resetting you can simple back up your all important data because in factory reset you will lose your all data so after that click on reset and then your watch will be take 10 minutes or 9 to 10 minutes to reset okay so if you found this video helpful don't forget to like share and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial goodbye